you might be thinking well why would i come to this platform and why would i not use google categories for example uh, youtube videos some people like to watch videos you want to get in touch with who is the best at you want to know obviously who is the best at it and, and i would want this to exist hey there welcome to this video so it's april of 2022 i have no clue how three months have passed um whatever let's just get over this okay so in this video i'm going to share an idea uh, all about it why i'm going to make it what would be what would be what is the vision and uh, all of it right also start off started working on it so here's the idea okay uh, imagine a place uh, on the internet where you could just go and uh, if you want to learn something creative obviously like programming writing reading uh, you know great stuff right you want to learn something you chose a category uh, for example you have programming you tap that you get to see all the things that you can learn in programming like languages uh, frameworks or whatever right there are lots of things once you tap that for example let's say you tapped on uh, rust okay so rust i want to learn rust so i come to this page which has rust and test and this page it has all the resources which has been crowdsourced or uh, contributed by people uh, they have been rated by people who have learned it and given comments and whatnot uh, and they are just sorted you can filter them and whatnot and uh, and and you might be thinking well why would i come to this platform and why would i not use google so when you uh, search about learning something on google it will show you some youtube videos you, which you don't know is the best or not or a lot of articles which you don't know which is the best one which people have you know massively used or what not obviously the uh, first ones are great and all that but it's not specific right if i want to learn something why is not there a place where i could just go and i should not just know this so what will happen is that in a, let's come back to our app okay so there there will be rust and there are resources which are user rated over the time they are crowdsourced people you know just upload resources and they also rate the existing ones and not just that the resources will be categorized into all sorts of uh, you know uh, categories for example uh, youtube videos some people like to watch videos some people like to watch blogs so there will be blog section uh, with that there will be books some people write, uh, like to read books there will be book recommendations and there is very beautiful resources that if you want to learn something you want to get in touch with who is the best at you want to know obviously who is the best at it and who are the at least the uh, people who are really good at it right uh, there will be a section called people or whatever um, you know for example uh, if you go to uh, twitter and see there are many programmers who are just sharing a lot of great things about languages and they're good at it right um, so why not a beginner who wants to get really good at things good at things not want to have that guy on his feed so the point is if someone is trying to get good at things he should know the top people in that field and you know just learn from them so, so there will be a people's category where you can know the people in the world who are great at that skill right um so that would be pretty cool and you know i would want that so so the point is that uh, i want to and like i would want this to exist like i would i would if i want to learn for example writing right um it's very underrated but very powerful thing uh writing i don't know like i i will just search something and just start uh you know uh, reading that or i will go to if there was a place that there were these uh these are the videos you know you should watch these are the blogs you should read top these are the top things in the world right these are the top things according to users according to all sorts of things and um, these are the people you should follow these i mean you become what you consume so uh, these are the people you should follow and i would want this to exist right so that's the main um, you know one of the reasons why i want to make it and second reason why i want to also make it is that is that i want to also learn other things uh, instead of just full stack development it was great uh, it is really great because i i learned it from my motivation to learn at first was that well uh, if i have an idea i should be able to you know just for example i have this idea and i will be now i can now make it right so this was it worked right but i also want to learn other things because well you know, i mean there are a lot of other cool things too right um but the problem with learning is that when you try to learn another thing or the other thing that you were good at just goes away do not let that happen the point is you have to uh, you know just keep uh, keep doing something related to it for even at least an hour or two hours a single every single day yeah, so i just thought you know i had this idea i would love this platform to exist and uh, you know i could also just maintain this for years and uh, because because this uh, the thing about this idea is that it's uh, it has it will have crowdsourced data so then more people will join uh, the more uh, 
ratings will be happening the more contributions will be happening the more resources will be filled the more the people the more the community better right um so that's the idea right and also uh, i get to commit to a project so that's the idea why i'm going to do it and also let me show you the v1 features that i have planned i have named it learn verse yeah i don't know but yeah this is the vision the vision is uh, in whatever years three to two years or whatever uh the this will be the go-to place for creatives and learners to learn anything on the internet because they will get the aggregated resource from all the categories that could there be uh, that could be for learning in one place about one thing and that's the vision um text uh, tech stack is you know uh, the things i know backend node express mongodb and um yeah next is chakra ui chakra ui is actually really is uh, is great uh, i just was reading the developer docs recently and it's like great and yeah i've set all this up another cool thing is that um i have made um so to just remove this friction of me you know i have an idea and there's a friction between us starting a new project what i did was i made a the back end with authentication included everything i have just put it uh, online open source yet you can just fork it for your projects too and it has authentication built in which has access token everything and all that cool stuff and user validation i mean it's it's almost production level mongodb uh, thing but i'm saying almost because well i have not been a professional back end developer but well, i've seen uh, this uh, i mean the patterns and all of that uh, it's it's pretty good okay it, it has user validations and all sorts of things right uh, the back end i'll be showing that sharing all the links to this um, code repository um, below in the description and okay front front end too i just have made this uh, next js uh, uh, template with chakra ui redux or redux toolkit query all integrated it has i have so included some examples too if you don't know how to use uh, redux toolkit query or simple redux uh, uh, slices right i have included examples all of the things it will just you know remove the friction of me having an idea to implementing it so i just open sourced it i'll be leaving both these code repositories in the uh, description you can just clone them and you know you can if you just have idea you can just use them right why to um, spend time on these things right okay so these are the v1 features that i have uh, thought uh, to include um so just put it out there okay um so full authentication flow user can anyone can sign up sign in uh log in log out all the stuff um and um show card so so this is how it will look the show there will be category of things i'll be focusing on programming mainly first category because i know most about it and obviously the first data that needs to be up out there uh, needs to be done by me because oh, i'm making it and no is no one is going to you know just uh, start uploading the resources on some random thing that random app that popped up right out of nowhere so i'm going to make all these things so programming all those things will be uh, yeah just good and probably i'll reach out to people to just ask for help if you know some great resources just you can upload them here right um, that will be done um so this will be the sort of thing and there will be profile page for the user if you are uh, contributing you need to get some points so there will be like this words points or something like that for user contributions uh yeah whatever right uh, and uh, yeah it pays for top contributors so this is the v1 feature i mean this uh, this idea could just go anywhere i don't know um because it's, um yeah that's that but yeah the main thing is that that resource page that is the main thing Um, but yeah it it can go anywhere so yeah these were some things in my mind i just wanted to share and do let me know anything you want to say in the comments uh, anything if you think something should should be different if you think uh, you know something should is not that good and uh, anything you want to say let me know in the comments i'll be you know learning from them and yeah just talking to you guys so yeah um that's that um thanks for watching till now uh, it means a lot and i'll see you in the next one till then have a great day and keep building